Hi guys, welcome back to Mala Image. If this is your first time, hi, my name is Roche. I'm a lover of fashion, the business of fashion. I'm also a little obsessed with vintage. Today I went to the Salvation Army Superstore. That's the really large one in the Union City area. I love going here. Um, I don't always find something great, but it's such a mass um, space. Um, and it has a good mix of modern and vintage items. So there's a good chance of <laughs> coming out with something. So I'm going to just go straight into the come thrift with me and then I'll come back here and show you what I got. So for today's total, I spent $35.45. So I think I did pretty well. And I got pieces that I really wanted and I think are a really good addition to my closet, which is, you know, something I try to, you know, stay on top of and not go wild because, you know, you see all these pretty things and you want to take them all. But I think I did very well today. Let's go into <laughs> what I got. The first thing that I got, I did get, <laughs> I did get the bag guys. I just, I have been eyeing these little carpet like weekender bags for a while. And normally it's in like that beigey tan color. And when I saw it in this like um, blue gray type color, I'm just thinking it would go so well with denim. And I just love this. I love the duffel bag um, shape of it. It's in excellent, you know, pristine condition. I don't think it's ever been used. Um, the brand is Jordache. 
uh, nice little 90s <laughs> label, I think it is. But yeah, just in such a really good condition. And there's a little um, pocket here, is a pocket here. And inside is the rest of my haul because in Jersey City, they no longer do single use plastic. So you, you have to take your own bags and I forgot. So luckily I had this, I just chucked everything in here. And so let's get into it. Another awesome piece that I got that I know I don't have is, I got these little loafers guys. I, I couldn't let it go. I love a black and white shoe. I've been eyeing black and white shoes for years. There's even a Chanel one that I had my eye on. I know, you know, I'll go into the designer shoes every now and then. But when I saw this, this is like um, brand new. It is genuine leather and it's by Kenneth Cole. So just to bring it up a little closer, it is that little vintage flair that it has with these little appliques going around in the black and white. Um, this, I forgot what you call these, but just this like little feminine lapel type thing. Um, it is a cutout, so it's perfect for spring, summer. Um, and just this, the heel height will just make it very wearable. How it wears, I don't know. I'm hoping that because it is genuine leather, it will wear um, pretty well. The thing with shoe with loafers and stuff like that, when you when it comes to like where the um, toe section, you know, I don't know how this will wear, but this was eight dollars. Um, we have a little tag, seven ninety nine sticker inside. So this was seven seven ninety nine eight dollars. So I just decided, let's see, you know, why not? <laughs> but this is such a cool pair of shoes, though. I just had to, you know, I just had to give this a try. I, I told myself no more shoes. I'm trying to declutter the shoes that I already have, but I could not pass on this. So the next item I got was the white blazer. I've been looking for an oversized long lined white blazer for a while. And so when I found this, it is in really good condition. You know, there's no spots, etc. And I just really, really liked it. And what I loved right here is it's not a color. It's more like a mock lapel type situation. It doesn't go around the back. So it'll be nice and comfortable and casual, you know? So I'm so glad that I found this. This is by Black Label by Evan Picone. And this is what the label looks like. So not a real old piece. It is a size 16 um w so you know quite oversized on me but i think for just throwing it on just a very casual look this is perfect so the last thing i got was the suit guys i could not pass like i know it's gonna be a little big and that's why i was you know you saw me trying to figure out if it would, you know, would work. The blazers are okay when they're oversized, but you can't really fake the funk that much with <laughs> oversized pants. So I was really hoping that these work, but I could not pass on this. It is like this sage green pinstripe, 100% linen. Like how do I pass up 100% linen and we're heading into um, late spring, early summer. Like this is going to be the perfect thing to wear. So um, this is by Style & Co. It is um, a size 12. Even though it might be an oversized box, it's perfect for, you know, what's currently trending. You know, it's all about the oversized, more slouchy suit. So when I saw it in this color and in linen, it's perfect for right now. So this is the last thing that I got. So just looking at the front, it has um, just this little pocket here. The design of the, the blazer isn't my favorite. I love a double breasted. I wish it was double breasted, but I think, like I said, with this color and the fact that it's 100% linen, I just had to give it a try. And this is what the pants looks like so i'm really nervous about you know <laughs> the what the size of it 
um, this is what the back looks like but because it's linen and it's lighter fabric it'll be easier to like take um, the waist in a little bit so this is the final piece so a very small haul but I think each item is like gold <laughs> I definitely, definitely um, don't have any of these items currently in my closet. So it's definitely something that's going to boost it and, you know, just add to what I currently have. So that's excellent for me. <laughs> so here is what the blazer looks like just on its own. It is quite oversized. I definitely um, roll the sleeves and give it a more casual feel. I decided to go with a full black and white look because I wanted to also um, pair it with these shoes. So I've just thrown on my little stirrup, my little vintage stirrup pants um, and just keep the full black and white look for, <laughs> for the blazer and to show you what these shoes look like. They're so comfortable. Um, and they're just so sweet. Oh my god, I don't know. But they are just such a sweet pair of shoes. Very comfortable um, as well. So just to keep a very casual vibe, I just, you know, throw on this um, little canvas Isabel Morant tote because it has that like black and white vibe going on as well. And just keep it very black and white for this look. And yeah, I love, love this. Just a nice little white blazer is what I was missing in my closet and I threw on this baseball cap as well just because on um, for an everyday like errand run type situation this is probably how I just grab stuff to go um if I'm doing a lot of walking a lot of stops this would be just perfect it's just so comfortable but still very you know elevated um yeah it's not too sporty not too casual I just love this look. So for the final look, this is the suit and you can see the little pinstripes and I've just styled it casually with my vintage Etienne Agner like raffia bag just to keep it nice and casual and I've also paired it with a pair of sneakers. I could also style it with heels and a little crop top and you know dress it up and this is just a more like casual like everyday you know because it's linen it lends itself to being like really casual and just easy run around so this is the final look it's just a single button up um the pockets are here shock and all guys the pants has no pockets who does that there's just two little back pockets um <laughs> in the back here with the buttons which i would definitely not use so this is you know just what the suit looks like and i just love this yeah <laughs> So guys, that's it. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to let me know in the comment section what look was your favorite, what piece is your favorite, as well, if you haven't yet subscribed, I'd love for you to join the family. And if you did like this video, please give it a like and I'll see you guys in the next one.